Hello and welcome to Mahindral.com and you are watching with me our special series that is tips and tricks of algebra SSC. As you all know that SSC exam is uh, going to be on August. So, we have to be focused on the SSC exam. So, what uh, what are the tips uh, you can say what are the tricks in algebra we have. So, basically today I will discuss with you what are the tricks and what are the tips we have to keep in your mind while solving the questions from algebra. So, let us start the discussion here and you can see because you are not our YouTube subscriber then you are not unable you are not able to see our all videos as far as any exam is concerned. So, the first thing you can do here click on this button then you will be our YouTube subscriber and if you are our YouTube subscriber then things are very easy to search right. You can also like us on Facebook for upcoming quiz and for the uh, most important knowledge we can say and you can also download our Mahindra Guru app from Google Play Store or Windows for this app is also available in Windows phone now. So, start the discussion here. So, let us move to the important tricks or we can say the most important tricks of algebra you can see here. In this questions, I will give you a trick how to solve this question. What is the important factor here that will be important as far as the exam is concerned. Now, see here uh, we have given x square minus 2x plus 1 is equal to 0 or x plus 1 upon x is equal to 2. Basically, uh, this is the this is a single form which can be written, uh, written in the two different forms we can say uh, these things can be written as in the form of this. So, we have what we have given if x plus 1 upon x is equal to 2 right and then, from, then the question is asking find the value of x to the power 81 plus 1 upon x to the power 81 very most important question now see here always remember now firstly I will discuss with you how this comes from this formula or because this expressions now see here uh, x square minus 2x plus 1 is equal to 0 all right. Now, see here if x square we can write here plus 1 and if we will uh, take this minus 2x in the right hand side it will become uh, 2x positive right. Now, see if we take x common then x plus 1 upon x is equal to 2x right x x will be cancelled out. So, we can say that x plus 1 upon x is equal to 2 here. So, if you find the question in that form or in that form, so do not confuse here both are the same form of the same questions right. So, sometime examiners can examiner write this question in this form or we can say this question can be written as in this form also. So, basically we do not have to confuse in the examination now see here. So, what I am basically saying in this question if x plus 1 upon x is equal to 2 right if x plus 1 upon x is equal to 2 and we have to find the value of x to the power 81 plus 1 upon x to the power 81. Now, see here most of the student have confusion that sir if x plus 1 upon x is equal to 2 and the question is asking about the power of 81. So, we will have to be multiply the power of 81 both side. No, the confusion is here that most of the student have the same confusion which what I am what I am saying to you that most of the student what they did in the question what they do in the question that they multiply both side by 81. This is the wrong concept here. Now, see here logically you can see here if x plus 1 upon x is equal to 2 right. If x plus 1 upon x is equal to 2 and if you put the value of x is equal to 1 if you put the value of x is equal to 1 now see here if x is equal to 1 and we put the value of x in this x equation here we have x 1 plus 1 upon 1 is equal to 2 which satisfy the condition right. So, we can say that if x plus 1 upon x is equal to 2 x always be equal to 1 right. So, we have to find the value of this one now see here uh, the value of this one we can say x to the power 81 plus 1 upon x to the power 81 we have to find here now see here x to the power 81 plus 1 upon x to the power 81, 1 to the power 81 and plus uh, 1 to the power 81. Now, see here 1 to the power anything always gives 1 if 1 to the power 1 or 1 to the power 2 or 1 to the power 81 or up to 1000 and so on 1 to the power anything always give 1. So, here we have 1 always right. Now, 1 to the power 81 that is that will be equal to 1 on the same way 1 to the power 81 it is here 1. So, the answer will be equal to 2. Now, the important trick in this question is that if x plus 1 upon x is equal to 2, if x plus 1 upon x is equal to 2 always remember x to the power n or we can say x to the power anything except 0 1 x to the power uh, 2 3 4 example whatever is whatever in the question answer will be equal to 2. 
all right again i am repeating what i am saying if x plus 1 upon x is equal to 2 right if x plus 1 upon x is equal to and, and the question is asking about to the power of 81 to the power of 93 and the power of up to 1000 and so on whatever so answer will always be equal to 2 so without using pen and paper you have to pick the answer to right the condition is here if x plus 1 upon x is 2 then you will put the answer to here all right let us move to next uh, next question we can say next important tricks so which can be uh, based on the same formula see here if i am saying if x plus 1 upon x is equal to 2 then we have the condition answer will be will always be equal to 2 all right if x plus 1 upon x is equal to 2 and in the power of 81 power of 79 whatever the answer will be 2 but in this condition what i am saying if x plus 1 upon x is equal to minus 2 i am changing the question x plus 1 upon x is equal to minus 2 in this questions minus 2 is there so what will be the condition or we can say this expressions can be written as this one right both are the same expressions so don't confuse in the examinations if you find this expressions or this equation this equation so both are the same equation as far as the exam is concerned right so don't confuse in the examination now see what i'm saying if x plus 1 upon x is equal to minus 2 here right if x plus 1 upon x is equal to minus 2 here and we have to find the value of x to the power 79 plus 1 upon x to the power 81 now how we will calculate now see here again you have to see the logic here if x plus 1 upon x is equal to minus 2 here so if we put the value of x is equal to minus 1 right if you put the value of x is equal to minus 1 here then we have minus 1 then minus 1 will be equal to minus 2 because this satisfy the condition here so we can say that if x plus 1 upon x is equal to minus 2 then x will be equal to minus 1 all right now see here so what we got from, from this equation that if x plus 1 upon x is equal to minus 2 x will always be equal to minus 1 right now put the value of x in this equation so where in this expression we have x to the power 79 plus 1 upon x to the power 81 now see here uh, minus 1 to the power 79 and as you all know that minus 1 to the power if minus minus 1 to the power if it is an odd number it always give result in minus right so minus 1 to the power 79 and plus minus 1 to the power 81 now see here minus 1 to the power 79 will be equal to minus 1 and minus uh, plus minus will become minus here minus 1 to the power 81 will always be equal to minus 1 so answer will be equal to minus 2 all right remember this thing if x plus 1 upon x is equal to minus 2 and both the ex in expressions both the power are in odd right again i am repeating if x plus 1 upon x is equal to minus 2 and in the expressions that you have to find here both the power are in odd answer will be equal to minus 2 and if power are interchange or we can say if one is odd and other is even then answer will be what now see here in this question questions can be uh, asked in the examination for example if x plus 1 upon x is equal to minus 2 right now see here x plus 1 upon x is equal to minus 2 and the question is i am changing the question is here so we have x is equal to minus 1 and if we have to find here x to the power 80 for example and 1 upon x to the power 81 now see here if you have to find the value of this expression what is the answer now x is equal to here minus 1 right x is equal to minus 1 here x plus 1 upon x is equal to minus 2 then x will be equal to minus 1 this is our logic right now see minus 1 to the power 80 we know that minus 1 to the power if it is a even number it always gives plus value or positive value so here plus 1 is here right and plus is here and minus 1 to the power 81 again the same thing is here minus 1 to the power if it is an odd number it always gives negative result so we can say here minus 1 minus 1 plus 1 will be equal to 0 so always you have to remember if both powers are same or we can say if both powers are in odd so the answer will be in negative and if both powers in one is odd and one is even so answer will be 0 so you in so this things you have to keep in your mind if x plus 1 upon x is equal to minus 2 right let us move to next question and see what the next question and what is the next trick is here now see uh, next ne next thing you can see here if we have x plus 1 upon x is equal to 2 or minus 2 then we have uh, seen the condition and then we have seen the tricks now in this questions what we have given if x square 
minus x plus 1 is equal to 0. Now, see if x plus x square minus x plus 1 is equal to 0. So, this this things can be written as uh, if x square plus 1 taking uh, now see x square minus x plus 1 is equal to 0. Basically, what I am saying to you that x square minus x plus 1 is equal to 0 right and we have to find the value of this one. Now, see here as you all know that a cube plus b cube will be equal to a plus b right and what a square minus a b right a square minus a b plus b square is equal to 0. Now, this is the value of this expression that a cube plus b cube is equal to a plus b and a square minus a b plus b square sorry this is not equal to 0. Now, this is the value of this one. Now, see here. So, we can say that if x cube plus 1 is equal to now see x cube plus 1 is equal to x plus 1 right. Now, on the same way x square minus x plus 1 right. And what we have given in this question that x square minus x plus 1 that is equal to 0. So, if we put the value of this expression here 0, so we get x cube plus 1 is equal to 0. So, the trick is here if you find the expression x square minus x plus 1 0 in the examination right. If you find x square minus x plus 1 0 in the examinations always remember this result give x cube plus 1 is equal to 0 alright. So, the trick is here x square minus x plus 1 if is equal to 0 if then x cube plus 1 x cube plus 1 is equal to 0 always and we will follow the trick in this question. Now, see here what we have given x cube what we have given here x square minus x plus 1 is equal to 0 right and we have to find here x to the power 18 plus x to the power 15 plus x to the power 12 plus x to the power 9 plus 2 here. We have to find the value of this expression. Now, see here. In this question, if we have this expression, so we can say that x cube plus 1 is equal to 0. Now, see if we take x to the power 15 common here, x to the power 15 common here, then x cube plus 1 on the same way uh, we can take here common what x to the power 9. So, x cube plus 1 is here and plus 2 is here. Now, see if you have given this one on the basis of this one the conclusion is x cube plus 1 is equal to 0 x cube plus 1 is equal to 0 the whole thing will become 0 and the here whole thing will become uh, 0 on the same way and plus 2 is here. So, 0 plus 0 plus 2 answer will be equal to 2. So, the most important tricks you have to remember here if x square minus x plus 1 is equal to 0 then x cube plus 1 will always be equal to 0. So, on the basis of this tricks most of the questions can be asked in the examinations alright. So, if you find this type of question in the examination I hope you will be able to solve these questions using this trick right. So, this is all about for today's discussion. Hope you like this video. If you like this video, you can subscribe our YouTube channel. You can also like us on Facebook. You can also follow us on um, Instagram. You can download our Mahindra Guru app from Google Play Store and this app is also available in Windows phone now and always and one more thing give your likes and comment and feedback, feedback to this videos because your feedback and comments are most important part as far as the video is concerned right. So, at last your success is our success. Thanks a lot. Hope you like this video. Thanks a lot. All the best.